Good morning, guys. I've just woken up. It's 6 a.m. in the morning, and uh, today uh, I will show you one day in my life or one day in tennis coach's life. Uh, and it's not all about tennis. I will I will show you um, all the things I do during the day, uh, including like also uh, with the web tennis training, the online thing, with the uh, coaching, on-court coaching, mm, as well as other things. Like I'm running a little TV show, like a tennis show, the biggest in Latvia because that's pretty much the only in Latvia. Yeah, Latvia, it's the country I come from. Uh, yeah, the rest of the things as well, uh, I do as a human being. So I'm gonna hit a shower now uh, and see you at the breakfast table. So I just hit a shower, uh, didn't film that, sorry. Uh, made myself a nice little breakfast, this, it's an oatmeal, uh, coffee. I think oatmeal is a great option for a breakfast. Probably the best, uh, like a lot of carbs uh, to get you to get you uh, enough energy. Also, it makes you feel kind of full, and it's pretty tough to make me uh, feel full. And yeah, I mean my bags are packed. I'll finish this, and uh, I'm off uh, to my first tennis practice. It starts at 7.30 a.m. It's quite an early start. Uh, yeah, but that's how I start. And I'm uh, trying to be really quiet in the morning. I, I hope I hope I'm not talking too loud because my wife and my kid, uh, she is only three months old, so I hope they're still sleeping. I haven't woke them up because, you know, if you woke up three-month-old child, it's not good. Child is fine, but wife is not good. So, um, yeah, I just don't want to be a bad guy in early in the morning. So, I'm trying to eat really quiet. 7 a.m. It took me about an hour uh, to get ready without stress, uh, without any rush. Uh, took care of myself, had a nice breakfast. Uh, didn't. Uh, wake up uh, my girls which is important uh, and yeah I'm in my car now I'm driving to the tennis club it takes uh, 10 maybe 15 minutes to get there it's not far uh, and yes I spend a lot of time in my car um, and I like it it's kind of my second home actually I sleep in my car sometimes uh, well during the day um, when when I feel tired and uh, I feel I need a nap. I have this little 15 minute long nap. Sometimes I eat in my car. I think in my car a lot. I like actually the best ideas. And I have, I have had some good ideas, trust me or not. Uh, they've, uh, they've happened in my car. Uh, and yes, uh, really, I, 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 I like driving and uh, uh, I'm off to my first tennis practice, as I said, and uh, see you, see you there. So I'm at the tennis club. Uh, I tried to be there a bit earlier, just to warm up. And for me personally, the best warm up is uh, jump rope. Look, that's my jump rope. You see, it's actually broken. There are uh, no more handles. So that's a proof that I'm using my jump rope often. I think that's the best and the quickest way if you need uh, to warm up fast because I'm 33 uh, and I need to warm up otherwise it's not good so this is my buddy Harald he's an early bird he's a hard worker he's ready to hit before the school how do you feel before the school Ready, um, ready to go? Full yes, of energy? Yes. Okay, we're gonna practice for an hour and you will also see some bits of uh, our practice.
Heidi Hertz. Hi. You have a nice name. Yes. <laughs> Same as mine. National Under 12s champ. We're gonna practice for two hours. See how it goes. Maybe even more. Maybe even three hours, four hours, five hours. We'll see. Ready? Mm -hmm. Cool. So next, next up, one of the best DJs in Latvia. <laughs> the guy with the beautiful tattoos. Show, show, show some tattoos. Show your best tattoo. This is my latest. You see, you see? <laughs> so I have a really, really serious student. So that's it. Well, that's not it for the day. That's uh, it for the first part of the day. Uh, four and a half uh, straight hours of tennis. You see, wet t-shirts. Where's my other wet t-shirt? Oh, here it is. You see, two wet t-shirts. Uh, yeah, and it's playing. You see, I'm playing with my students. I'm not like standing in a corner and just screaming at them. So it's a lot of tennis. Uh, and to be honest, I enjoy um, playing and teaching instead of just staying in a corner and teaching. I really like it. It's pretty exhausting to be honest at, at, some, uh, at some stages, but overall I, I really like it. But now before I go to eat my lunch, I will uh, do some fitness training every day um, after my uh, first let's say tennis uh, practice part uh, of the day is done I try to squeeze in some fitness I do it every day um, it's not like I'm like showing off because I'm filming myself no I'm really doing it every day it's not like a crazy training with weights uh, it's more like a body weight training one day I focus more on core, one day I focus more on my upper body. Today it will be more on my upper body. I do a bit of legs every day. Uh, yeah, and I do it. I pretty much devote a lot of time to fitness. At least an hour every day. I do something just to make sure my body, uh, my body is, uh, is ready uh, to go through, through this, uh, this, this my, my work those many hours of tennis and also when the tournaments come I still play uh, I try to play often uh, that I'm ready I'm ready to go and I'm ready to play those three setters with uh, with uh, younger people so uh, see you in the gym I'm in my car again. 
my second home as I told you in the morning it's 12.30 uh, I'm heading to another tennis club first part of the day I'm in one club the second part in, in another club because it's uh, not that easy to get tennis courts uh, in, in Latvia you see it's cold uh, it's it's uh, second of uh, November when I'm filming this uh, and indoor tennis uh, it's not that easy there are not that many indoor facilities so I have to share my time in two clubs but they are pretty close to each other it's 10-15 minute drive again uh, <coughs> It's a little triangle, my home, then it's uh, this club I just played in, and then it's another club, and then it's my home again. So it's not, not a problem. I'm actually, as I said, I like driving, and I kind of feel like, well, it's, it kind of feels refreshing, like a little restart for the day. So yeah, I have a, uh, an hour and a half free. I will go to the club, uh, have a lunch, uh, and then, yes, at two o'clock again, again uh, two and a half hours of tennis and then uh, there will be after that there will be like my second uh, how to call it it's my tennis I'm a tennis coach and uh, in, in the second part of uh, the day there will be my other duties such as I'll become a journalist and web tennis training yes I devote time to, to, to my online uh, coaching as well and I do it at night I will show you that as well later uh, and I will also introduce you with my family uh, who are at the home at the moment a kid and my wife she takes care of uh, of, of uh, my daughter of our daughter the whole day then I come back and I will do some father duties as well uh, later today so yeah that's that's how it goes that's life. Jeez, it's it's autumn. It's really there are not many leaves left on 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 trees. I think it's gonna start snowing soon. So here I am in a tennis club's cafe, having a nice uh, little lunch. Look at that. It's like a fancy restaurant meal. It's like it's chicken, it's mashed potatoes, it's some cucumber salad, and uh, yeah. Uh, it's a tea as well. You know, I spent I spent uh, two years in Scotland, so kind of got British a bit. So I'm a tea guy now. Yeah, this is my quiet time. Uh, I have an hour till my next training. I will rest up a bit, uh, plan my training, and then uh, see you on courts. Here we go again, tennis, another club, the same game, another student, Darta, very intense, very hard working. Will you show off your uh, intensity? She will, she will, you will see, you will see a few drills. Here we go, it's Eriks. That's my last tennis session of the day. Eriks, he's a self-proclaimed next Rafa Nadal. If you, do, if you don't believe me, check out his Instagram. He's a wizard, so we're gonna hit the bit. Now Eriks will show you a nasty Rafael Nadal type slice serve. Is that your favorite serve? Yes. Hit that cone, man. It's 
okay. Keep going. Nice. That was actually better than hitting a cone. That was a really nasty slice. Hey, it's, uh, it's me on the floor again. Um, not again. I'm not on the floor again. It's me again. And I'm on the floor. Another two and a half hours of tennis done. Uh, and now it's time to to a quick recovery. Uh, you see I'm doing the leg drains. I'm like draining how to show them to you. Yeah. It's it uh, resting my legs. Uh, and then I stretch. I do stretching uh, every day. That's a must do thing. Uh, not 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 much. Like five, seven minutes. Uh, otherwise I'm as you saw I'm playing a lot of tennis. If I'm not doing that, I'm done. But if I'm stretching, fine. Oh, yeah, it's uh, seven hours of tennis. Um, today was kind of uh, average day. Seven, seven, uh, six, seven hours of tennis, Monday to Saturday. Maybe a bit less on Saturday. But that's, yeah, that's, that's how I uh, work on court. Maybe today it was a bit easier day uh, because you saw that mainly I played with some younger juniors. Uh, sometimes you have to play. I have uh, students like 17, 18 year old uh, juniors, especially some boys. And if I have to play a practice set, for example, then it's pretty physically demanding, even more demanding. Um, but I really like it because it helps me to, uh, uh, to stay in shape as well. Uh, as I said before, I still, I still play tournaments when when there are tournaments in my region, uh, and then yeah, then playing faster tennis with some decent juniors uh, really helps. Plus, it's really interesting to to help those juniors uh, grow their game. Uh, yeah, that's that's how I actually uh, teach people. Uh, you saw saw some drills and. You saw some some clips from the training, um, and some of you who have uh, read my book, uh, my tennis book, Shortcut to Success, uh, you've probably uh, heard that I'm big believer in in leading by an example. Uh, that's why I play myself. That's why I grind, uh, because I truly believe that that's the best way uh, is to show show kids, show, show juniors, even show adults, uh, recreational players, just to show example, uh, to show how it should be done. Because if I just stay in a corner and, and just talk and do this, do that, that's not working. So yeah, it's, it's all about showing example. And uh, I, I love it. I love playing. I love sweating. So you see, it's a uh, Bad t-shirt number three. Uh, yeah, now it's time for more uh, brain part of the day. It's 4.30 and uh, I'm about to to go to my, my studio and uh, do this uh, TV show uh, about tennis, weekly TV show about tennis uh, together with my dad. So here I am. Uh, preparing for my uh, TV show. It's actually not a TV show. It's a, a call it TV show with a show on Facebook Live. Uh, yeah, and I'm preparing for this now. Uh, watching uh, news about tennis, uh, making some notes uh, because uh, what we do weekly, we talk about tennis uh, in, 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 in a, about worldwide tennis, about Latvian tennis. Uh, we discuss very important topics, um, about 30 minutes, uh, but the preparation is, I would say, close to an hour. So uh, yeah, I'm a bit in a hurry at the moment. Uh, so it's 5.30 p.m. My TV show, uh, sorry, Facebook show, Facebook live show starts in 30 minutes. The vase says I need 27 minutes to get there, so as always, last minute. I'm in last minute for my TV show. But I got a, I got a coffee 
and add a snack, I like little baby croissant, and I have one something in this package with the baby croissant, there is like some kind of crusty carb, I'm not sure what it is, but I want something, I probably can give this to my kid, no I can't, you can't give the things until your baby has reached four years of age, so I'll keep it for four years. I made it. This is our little studio for our weekly tennis show. This guy over here is my dad. He's actually came up with this idea about the show. Uh, and yes, we're about to film our latest episode. 30 minutes of pure brilliance of tennis. So I'll go take my spot over here. That's how we sit. You see the green screen, stuff like that. Can switch on. Are we alive? Yeah, we are alive. Oh, stone, there was a tennis man in the show. Now we're going to be a synotip. Now we're going to be a synotip. We're talking about the tennis actual I'm driving back home. Um, I just finished listening uh, our show. It's actually called Tennis Mania in Latvian. Uh, it means uh, tennis mania, I guess. Yeah, uh, in, in English. Um, yeah, I uh, listened the whole episode. I always try to listen to the, the episode because just to see how it looks, uh, to hear how it sounds. Uh, just to evaluate myself and make uh, every next show better. This time it was okay, despite the fact that I was late. But who cares? Um, yeah, maybe our sponsors care, but that's life. Uh, yeah, I'm uh, I'm about to pop into the shop now. I need to buy some basic groceries and 20 liters of uh, water. Water is very important, very important. And uh, I'll be home soon. Yes, I'm home. Oh, oh, there are my girls over here. Kaim Slabit. They're chilling. It's 8.30 p.m. We are at the dinner table, all of us. Look. There's Anette, my wife. Hi. Hi, I want to say hi. Wave, hi. wave, wave, wave. You see over there, like the big one. Where is like my finger? Yeah, that one is the big 20 liter water bottle. I told you. Oh, and yeah, and here is our baby. You see behind the bananas, Carolina. Pasak ciao. Say hi. Carolina tennis baby. She already has her Instagram account, by the way. Yes, uh, and it's our uh, it's our dinner. We have uh, buckwheat, you see, a little buckwheat with some, uh, how to turn, some chicken. How is it called? Pudjka post. Cauliflower, I guess. Right? Yeah. Uh, and other goodies, some salad. And zucchini. And zucchini as well. Cool. We don't have drinks. Hmm. We need to drink a water. It's Shoot. I forgot. Oh, we have cucumbers, like little little <laughs> cucumbers <laughs> as well. See? No, but and it's. candles. Yes, and candles. On it, she uh, burnt her uh, nails a bit while trying to. while trying to make things look beautiful. I forgot to buy. Coke Zero. To be honest, that's my guilty pleasure. Mm. As you saw, I drank, I, I drank a lot of water during the day, and you kind of get sick of water a bit. Yeah, and my guilty pleasure is Coke Zero. Um, not more than one bottle per day, no, but uh, I drink it, yeah. But luckily, I forgot to buy it. Yes, and we're going to have a dinner now. And afterwards, we'll have fitness training and tennis training for this little 
human being over there behind the bananas. Here's a fitness training going on, you see. Aneta, that's her responsibility to work on Carlina's fitness. She's almost four months old. And her biggest fitness achievement is to turn from her back to her front, which is pretty big. You see, they work on it every single day for a multiple times. When you are ready, she does it. Carlina, come on, turn again. You can do this, baby. You can do this. She's tired. Yes. But we need to push her. We don't. Ca okay, I'm kidding. Oh, you see? You see? Yes. You see? It's all about hard work. Good. 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 Okay, baby. Now rest a bit. And you are going to have a fitness. No. What am I talking about? Come on, man. A tennis training. So we'll start with a forehand, Carolina. Yeah, let's do it. Semi-western forehand grip, shoulder turn, and here you go. Seven forehands. Let's go. Accelerate. 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 Yes. Nice. Her forehand is actually more fluent than mine. Some backhands? Sit some backhands? Yes? Let's take some two hands. Let's put some two hands on the racket. Yes, let's put some two hands. Uh, shoulder turn and follow through. Follow through. Accelerate. 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 Two more. And one more. Last one. Last one and nice backhand. Almost as good as mine. You see, we teach, teach her left handed game. Well, it's we have no clue if she's right handed or left handed, but we will learn tennis with left hand. The same as Rafa Nadal. You know that Rafa Nadal actually is not a lefty, he's a righty. He just plays tennis lefty so that his opponents are struggling with his slice serve and with his topspin and volleys. Here we go. Last 10 shots. Five forehand volleys, five backhand volleys. So let's go. Hands in front and one, <laughs> two, three, four, five, backhand. One, two, three, four, Five game set and match Carlina. Yeah. That was our tennis training. <laughs> it's easy, you see? She thinks like tennis is easy. Tennis is easy, Dad. Why are you making such a big deal of it? It's just easy. You just beat people. Right? Do you like tennis? We are a lovely family and we love lying on the ground. Because that's the one of the rare things Carlina is really good at, lying on the ground. Carlina, you need a solarium maybe? You what you're whitish, don't you? You need sun. You need to go on holiday to some islands. Hello, what are you doing? Feeding the baby. <laughs> I mean, her last meal of the day is my responsibility. But that's tough, isn't it, to be all day with a kid? No, it's easy. That's not it's tough. So my day is coming to an end. Um, everybody's sleeping, girls are sleeping. Uh, me. I'm working with my second baby or web tennis training. Yeah, that's what I normally do. I do it late at night. Uh, before Carlina was born, I had more time uh, to, to work on web tennis training. Because as you saw, as I came home, I, I had a nice time with my family. A few hours 
and I put uh, put them both to sleep and uh, now I spend an hour normally from 11 p.m. to, to 12 to midnight uh, doing my things let's say uh, at the moment it's Monday uh, I'm working on my uh, motivational uh, motivational uh, picture um, and actually yeah, I had I had a little snack had a yogurt with a banana I'm a tea guy as I said spent two years in Scotland and yeah I'm working on that plus uh, I'm uh, answering uh, to, to the questions of, of people who had bought my product called ask me five tennis questions plus they get a free book I do this a few more questions to ans answer um, and then yeah um, pretty much I have to start sorting out also these videos I filmed today it's quite a lot of material it's 11 55 p.m. Uh, so I will make uh, in my bed on time that's my goal uh, to get uh, into my bed before the midnight so that I can sleep at least six hours because tomorrow uh, I wake up again uh, 6 a.m. Um, it's not a lot of sleep um, but uh, it works for me mm, I feel a bit tired by the end of the week but then uh, I uh, catch up on my sleep on the weekend especially uh, on, on Sunday and uh, it was a nice and busy day. Uh, thank you for uh, watching this and thank you for uh, kind of requesting me uh, to make uh, such a video. I really enjoyed it. It was a busy day, yeah, as I said. I actually checked my uh, smartwatch. Uh, it said that I've made um, 27,000 uh, steps, which equals 22 kilometers. Plus, I did some uh, light strength training as well a little bit facebook live or so-called journalism and of course web tennis training uh, working on uh, on that filming answering your uh, questions uh, doing a lot of other stuff um, and thank you guys for uh, becoming more and more active uh, as a web tennis uh, training community it's really nice and uh, uh, don't hesitate um, to contact me, to email me, to message me, uh, to comment, um, subscribe, etc. Uh, it, it, it really it makes me happy. It really makes me uh, want to continue doing what I'm doing. All right, guys, enough talking. I'm off to bed and uh, talk to you soon.